Nelson Palacio and Brian Ojeda will sit, destroy, disrupt, and protect. Michael Chang, 10th started the season on one side. Jefferson Saverino on the opposite. The road. Yeah, two of them across the back line. Tafari alongside Sebastian Ibiaga. Emma Tumasi straight off that appearance against Seattle back into the starting side. Midweek match day number 33. We are underway at America First Field. It is the Claret and Cobalt. Chicho Arango who scored in three straight games. Chang, immediate cross looking for Krylak. Oh, nice volley attempt from that far side. Oviedo, great save in front by Pa. Over Dallas and others as it stands. They could put themselves into a top four position with the three points tonight. Ojeda. Gets it back from Chang. Ojeda underneath the Tafari. Third big save of this half for Martin Paz. Demir Krylak in the 11. He has not scored since June 21st. We haven't touched on the Danny Masovsky situation. Has it been with the club? Uh, some contract disputes. We'll see if that's resolved. We asked Pablo about it. He knows it's key as Krylak now gets the yellow card. The process there in Atlanta. It was up on that knee. They will take a look. And this He's is going to be, be rough. Off. Yeah. And RSL I are would not be surprised if he sent off. Yeah, it's momentum, it's force, and it's the idea, has he endangered the safety of the opponent? No, he's not going to do it. He's just going to keep it on yellow. You're, you're talking about a player which I'm still not sure is number six or potentially a number eight. Maybe more of an in-between. Uh-oh. Pereira. Oh, McMath! He looked back over his shoulder at the right possible moment. The ball was turned over. He had about 25 yards to get back to. A decent job in this first 43 minutes play. There's been some sloppy moments in the back for Dallas. Severino. Far fans so defensively sound. Ojeda thumps it in for Chicho! There's a goal! 43rd minute. It's the goal scoring machine. Chicho Arango with goals in back to back to back. To back games. Try to build out of the back. You turn the ball over, and then you concede a goal through a throw in. Who's got Chicho Rongo? Nobody. Snap down header, far post. Nothing Paz can do about it. And in the 43rd minute, FC Dallas concedes, and Chicho Rongo once again just ruthless. How do you overcome them psychologically, physically turn them into results that you're looking for? And ultimately snatch a point from the jaws of defeat, and then even snatch three points from the jaws of a draw. Pomacal gets it from opening. Ah, and it's there! Paul Ariola started the sequence, and he ends it. And it's a second half goal for FC Dallas. And maybe it uncorks this attack. Ariola with his second of the season. But this buildup, really nice. defensively just so soft from Real Salt Lake. Less preferred right foot, right through the legs of Marcelo Silva. It starts with Ariola, cuts inside as he plays through Pomacall. Pomacall finds Obreon, plays Pomacall again. Cutback ball. Where is the marking on Paul Ariola? He's untouched. It's a simple tap in. And he's leveled the scoreline for the visitors in the 56 minute. Dallas, so good signs that he could be one they can rely on. It's whizzed across the top of the defensive line. And boy, did Paz have to get down for that. Yep. And it looks like it comes off. Who is that? Frazier at the back post. Comes off the thigh and then the outside of the right leg. People ask, oh. who do you think is going to make MLS cover? I don't know. Weather turns and... <laughs> You shrug your shoulders. Oh, what a ball. Right there, a chance for Dallas to go in front. Silva. Oh, it's the first penalty since March of 2022. At the hour mark. Ding dong, the witch is dead. It's to show the yellow card to Marcelo Silva. Ball drops for Obreon. He comes over. Now the question is, he's making a genuine attempt to play the ball. He's launched himself up and over. Has he gone through Obreon to get to the ball he has? He's gone through Obreon to get to the ball right there. Now from that angle, it doesn't show you completely.
The streak is over. Will they convert? Fedena does! Goal, Ariola! Goal from Fedena! That goal scoring partnership that has served Dallas so well have done it again here in Sandy, Utah. It was the plan. Saba for Oviedo. Back to Sabarino. Oh, what a shot! Paz got over there. That was on its way in. Claw, this is. He gets up full stretch. This has eyes far post side net. You'd want your guys to start with, but he's perfect in that role. He's happy in that role. But now they could really use a goal from him. It's been a minute. His last goal was in the Open Cup against Houston, which was a bad night in those semifinals. Dallas with numbers. Obrian Fededa! Three straight unanswered. And Jesus Fededa will find a way to that top page for the Golden Boots. Gets two here tonight when Dallas needed it most. With the press for FC Dallas, soft turnover as Justin Glad tries to find Jasper Loffelsen. As that ball gets cut out, he steps, quick combination. Jesus Ferreira doesn't go down. Obreon finds him, opens up his hips, far post, side net, goalkeeper at his mercy. 3-1 on the road for FC Dallas after giving up a crucial goal in the dying moment. Oviedo, Luna, little shake. Lawful send! Much safer ground. It is over. Huge win for FC Dallas. Just there, a third away win. And big questions for Real Salt Lake.